there's like a pole. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, welcome I to the pole. I have pole in my face yesterday. I'm Percy. This is Mercy, and behind the pole is Mercy. <laughs> I had the pole in my face yesterday. Did you? Did you learn? Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Hi. Every day, every day we upload a new video. Awkwardly into the frame. Oh man, how are we gonna? It's fine. Up? Just don't include me. I can be on the side. <laughs> All right. See, I mean, people people think vlogging is easy because we just do it like two weirdos over breakfast, but it's kind of hard. Uh, what's on the agenda today? Oh, guys, today, Happy Tuesday, September first. Today is Emma M. -M. Nut Day, N-U-T-T. -T. Emma M. Nutt was back in 1878. She was the first female phone operator. Before she took the job, it was done by men, and it sounds like historically they weren't doing very well at it. They were, I mean, I'm sure some, some folks were, but they were, like, phone operators were, like, pulling pranks, bad service, but then Emma shows up, she does this insanely good job, and she does it for like 37 years after that. So wow. she was like, had this big impact on f being a phone operator. And so I, she, she just stands out as, as like another great example of doing a job men have historically done, and a woman can do anything. I thought about your question for that, like if there's any recent examples. Oh boy, you gotta get in here. Oh no, but I'm so like, in, I'm an, like an angel. In the... Let's see if we can, oh, okay. Let's see if we can get the angel uh, in some better lighting here. And I think Rachel herself is an example because sort of historically men have been the ones who have gone out there and done like the motivational speaking and lots of times she says she's looking for like mentors and people to like talk to to, to further herself in her career and she's having trouble finding you know women who are doing what she's doing already so she's kind of blazing a little bit of the field there. I mean, there's obviously other women who are doing it too, but. Yeah, cool. Okay, let's let's finish this quick then. <laughs> Sacrificing yourself for the sun. Okay, do, uh, I don't know, half and half here. Get closer, there we go, there we go. Are you in there? Okay, so Emma Nut Day, trailblazer for, for operators, for women becoming phone operators. Thought that was an inspirational story, so. The story of the day is Hilary Swank is about to be in a new Netflix series that starts September 4th, I think, where she is going to be the first female uh, space astronaut leading an expedition to Mars. We will return home. The trailer looks amazing. Good, good wife. Will is in it as her husband, who plays this guy who has to stay on Earth. No, he's not Will the lawyer. He, he's Will the lawyer who becomes a engineer for NASA. Oh, okay, got it. I've ever known for sure in my life is that I wanted to be on the first mission to Mars. So he's in it as Hilary Swank's husband who has to stay on Earth with their daughter while she goes on a three-year expedition to Mars. So it's full of drama, full of intrigue, full of space craziness, I don't know. Sounds, it looks awesome. Are they uh, sponsoring us today? Netflix is a sponsor of this video. <laughs> <laughs> Are we gonna get any sponsors, Percy? I'm working on it, I'm working on it. Somebody actually okay. wrote in. Uh, they want us to sponsor their microphones. I don't know, maybe we don't really use la lavalier mics, but maybe, maybe we'll get into this, I don't know. Yeah, and then they want asked us if we wanted to do a giveaway. Maybe someone out there would like a lavalier mic and I don't know. I don't know. Maybe we're, I've got I've got things in motion. Let us know. Let us know if you use a lavalier mic, and I, we're working on it. Also, if you want to sponsor one of these videos, let me know. Maybe maybe something can happen here. Here's a joke. Watersport430 says, "I like to write jokes down from this subreddit and store them on my phone. I call it my database." <laughs> Remember what a database is? A database. Database, exactly. But if it's a database of dad jokes, it becomes your... Oh, uh, database. Because it's dad jokes. Yeah. <laughs> Lynette snorted. Good. It is pretty good. And Lynette is a fantastic producer of this video. She <laughs> blocks the sun for us with her body. <laughs> There's a brewery in that church over there. That's cool. 
Zach, you are so close to us. Here we go, we are kayaking. Good job, buddy. It's kind of nice when someone paddles for you. I gotta get back in, <laughs> back in business, we're about to crash. <laughs> Okay, this is going really well. Now everybody's frightened by a spider outside. <laughs> okay, let's... It's a spider. Okay. 